This is StormTrack 12. It was another winter-like day today, and while we'll still be pretty cold for the overnight, we are looking forward to a little bit of a warm-up as we head into the weekend. But taking a look outside, we're currently at 24 degrees here in Binghamton with winds in the north-northwest at 3 miles an hour. In this wider view of satellite and radar, you can see what's left of those lake effect snow showers that we've really been dealing with throughout much of the day today. And even into yesterday, we're really only left with a few snow flurries and they'll continue to taper off as we head into the rest of the night tonight. But temperatures are very chilly out there right now in the 20s across the area. Oneonta and Stanford both at 21 degrees, Sydney at 27. Green and Lyle are both at 26 degrees and Binghamton is at 24 degrees and the official high temperature at Binghamton today was only 25 degrees, which set a record for the lowest maximum temperature for this day being the old record of 26 degrees. So for tonight, those snow showers are going to come to an end over the next couple hours and we are going to start warming up by Friday and into the weekend. Rain returns to the forecast for Monday and then we're back to some more seasonable temperatures in the 40s for next week. But here's a look at our temperature outlook for November 26th through December 2nd. This is giving us a 40 to 50% chance of seeing above average temperatures for that time period. But our average temperature for the end of November, beginning of December is only 39 degrees. So we're looking at temperatures in the 40s for that time period. But here's a look at future track throughout the rest of the night tonight. Over the next couple hours, having those snow showers come to an end, and then we're looking at mostly clear skies to start the night. Then as we head into tomorrow morning, we'll start to see an increase in cloud cover, and then we'll see a mix of sun and clouds for much of the day tomorrow, although we are going to see some warmer temperatures in the 40s, and then we'll see, once again, a mix of sun and clouds for your Friday. But temperatures... By 9 o'clock, we'll be right around 20 degrees, and that'll actually be our low temperature for the night. And as we see that increased cloud cover into tomorrow morning, temperatures start to increase. By 6 o'clock tomorrow morning, we'll be in the upper 20s to near 30 degrees. By lunchtime, we warm up to near 40 degrees, and highs for tomorrow will top out in the mid to upper 40s. By tomorrow evening, we're into the 30s and lows for tomorrow night will be in the 30s to near 40 degrees. But for tonight, we're looking at a low temperature of 20 degrees, which will come early tonight, mostly clear skies and another cold night with that range of temperatures being 17 to 23 degrees. Winds start to die down as well. But here's a look at the rest of your seven day forecast. For tomorrow, a mix of sun and clouds, the high of 46 degrees. And Friday, going to be the warmest day of the week with a high of 55 degrees. We stay in the 50s throughout the weekend. Then a cold front passes through Sunday into Monday, bringing us some rain chances with the highest rain chances coming on Monday, then we drop down to some much more seasonable temperatures in the 40s for Tuesday and Wednesday.